Now, congratulations. How good does this feel to get it all sorted? Yeah, I'm happy to sign again, to um, sign more years to the club that I've been at since I was about seven years old. I'm just happy to just push on now. Um, has it been playing on your mind, your future? Uh, a, a little bit, yeah, because I've been injured, but I believe in my ability and, and I've got a good relationship with the club and they know my quality as well, so I just need to make sure that I've pushed back, yeah. Because I imagine it's been not just a frustrating few months, a frustrating year, year and a half for you. Yeah, definitely, but that's in the past. I'm hopefully a couple of weeks back from training and you can't really think about the past now, but I just need to push on in the present and the future because if I keep thinking about that, it might hold me back. So, yeah, just need to keep just thinking positively. Yeah. Does it help you almost appreciate the position when you are fit? Yeah, definitely. Like, where you are. It, like, it gives you a little, just, motiv like, it gives you motivation of where you want to be and obviously where the club's going. I want to be there as well and obviously help because the club's in a good, like, it, they're looking good and I just want to be involved with it. Yeah, definitely. Because it feels like a long time ago now when everyone was raving about you after that performance against Swansea in pre-season and we were all thinking, is this going to be the time when Niall makes the big breakthrough? Yeah, definitely, but that was a year ago, but that's how football is. Sometimes it's up and downs, but I just need to keep thinking positively and hopefully the fans will be just knowing about me more and more, so yeah. Because you've had a, a little taste of being away from Wolves as well this year with Shrewsbury. Yeah. What was that like? Because it's the first time for you in your footballing career. Yeah, it's something new, but obviously I have to back my um, personality to speak to new players and it's a good learning curve as well. Because if um, I do push up to the first team at Wolves one day, they're new players to me as well. Like they'll have to get used to me in more of an, more on a personal level. So it's good learning curves for me, it's only for the good, yeah. Because we've talked in the past about the fact that you're a local boy, Wolves fan, or your mates have been in stands watching your games and stuff. So yeah. to actually have to go away from here to try and experience that something else, I guess changes you as a character a little bit, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, it just gave me a taste of like being more a man as well, because obviously I'm growing up and... 18 now? Yeah, 18, yeah. Um, obviously, here I'm, I'm in a bubble really, because I've been here since I was seven. It seems like it's my second home. So leaving it, it makes me appreciate where I'm at as well, like more and more. You only see, you only see like how good a position you're in when you're not there. So, but Shrewsbury's been good to me as well. So yeah. So what's the plan moving forwards now? I know that you're close to getting yourself back fit again. I'm not sure exactly. My loan is a season loan, but I just want to focus on getting back fit wherever I'm playing. If it's here at Wolves or if it's at Shrewsbury, I just need to make sure I'm ready to be playing and being me, just enjoying football. Yeah, definitely. Scoring goals. Scoring goals, yeah. Because yeah. I guess there must be a part of you that's looked at what Morgan's achieved in the last couple of months. I mean, because you were high up in the England rankings before your injuries and yeah. you know, I guess even looking at Bright and Connor and these other young players that have come through and thinking I want a taste of that. Yeah definitely um, some people might start when you're injured just looking at them and feeling disappointed and feeling sorry for themselves but I use that as motivation for players that I've played with I can do that as well like I use it to just like spur me on and just think positive and hopefully that's me one day and it should be me one day because I, be I believe in myself and people around me do as well. I just need to make sure I'm there to take my chance, yeah.